Gas. Ida, what are you doing here? I found something that might help you. Weren't you supposed to see the doctor? Ida, please don't do this. Do what? Help. Why can't I help you? Because it's dangerous. Don't you know there's a seriously deranged man roaming the streets, preying on women? Oh, I can handle myself. I don't doubt that for a second, but I'd like to know that you're somewhere safe so I can concentrate on the case and not worry about you. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. I... What have you found out? Oh, it's really good. I was asking a few questions of some of the women. Anyway, one of them admitted that she'd heard that one of the victims survived an attack and was hiding in the scrapyard. That's great. But how reliable is the source? I have to admit it's only a rumor. But isn't it worth taking a look? Yes, it is. Be careful. I will. Stay off the streets, but first go see the doctor. Yes, I will. I'll see you later. A and Ida? Yes? Thanks for the info. You're welcome, and I love you too. on. That looks like Ida's last roast. What kind of a moron parks there? Uh-oh. I'm out of here. Hey, Kubina, open up. We need to talk. What do you want? I'd like to ask you a few questions. About? First off, I'd like to clear the air between us. I'm not after your girls. I'm just trying to find the killer, and that's all. You expect me to believe that? Yes, I do. Well, I don't. Everyone wants something. Just stay out of my business, McPherson. Yes, I do want something from you, but it's not your girls. Hmm. I'm listening. Let's exchange favors. I'll do something for you so that you can see I'm on the level with you. In return, all you have to do is tell that ape that's working for you to leave me alone. Hmm. Actually, there is something you could do for me, McPherson. I thought so. The gorilla's brother is locked up, isn't he? 
Yes. Roman is a good resource and is the girl's main protection. Without him, let's just say, if you can spring him out of jail, I'll tell the gorilla to leave you alone. Why'd he get arrested? It was some sort of incident with the police. He supposedly punched one, I heard. So, we have a deal then? Wait, not so fast. Why do you want Peter off your back? I need to talk to the person he's protecting. Ah, Vladana. So she really exists? Yes, she does. Spring Roman from jail and I will let you talk to her. To be quite honest, I figured you'd be more difficult to convince. McPherson, we both win if you get this killer off the streets. When you catch him, business will return to normal. Now go! You're wasting time. gate with a car behind it. I'm definitely not going through there. I never figured out what that was. My favorites, the prisoner of Zenda. Hello again, my friend. Ah, Mr. McPherson. What brings you here this fine evening? Well, I need a favor. Hmm. I thought so. What can I do to help? I need you to be on the level with me about the Shiner. What do you mean? Come on, Kaz. What really happened? Why do you ask? The man you arrested yesterday, is he the same man that protects Otakar's girls? Yeah, he is. I thought so. I need this man free, because I can get precious information on the case. Can you help me? Yeah, I can help you. But I'd have to ask a favor in return. I would have been insulted if you didn't ask. What can I do to help? Well... It's, uh, it's sort of embarrassing. You can trust me. It's about the black eye, isn't it? Yeah. The night I arrested Roman, I noticed something missing. My, uh, my medal was gone. You have a medal? Yeah, I got a medal for bravery. I saved some children from the fire that happened a couple of weeks ago. Atta boy. Congratulations. No, oh, thank you. Anyway, I noticed my medal was gone, so I went back to see Apollina. Why'd you go see her? Well, I, uh... Never mind, I got gotcha. you. She stole it from me. I have no idea why. Maybe she needs the money. But I need that medal back. My wife is getting suspicious about it. It's my pride and joy. And saying I forgot it at the office just won't be good enough when I go home. Please, get it back for me. I love my wife and kids. I don't want to lose them over something so stupid. Relax, my friend. I got you covered. I'll get that medal of yours. Just make sure that you can free Roman for me when I return. Thank you, my friend. I'll see you later.
Oh, you again. Stop wasting my time. Wait a second, will you? You are truly annoying. I have information for you. It's about Roman. Interested? What is it? First of all, you're gonna have to give me the medal you stole from Stasek. Why the hell would I want to do that? So you admit it. You did steal his medal. Yes, I did. That son of a bitch didn't pay me, so yeah, I stole his precious medal. Just because he's a cop, he can hump me and leave me without paying? Hell no, not me! Okay, so? What happened? He came to see me when he finally realized that I had it. He started grabbing me, and threatened to arrest me. Roman happened to be walking by and he broke up the commotion. He ordered me to go home, so I left. Well, let me finish the story for you. He got arrested for punching Stasek in the face. Now Roman is in jail. So, what do you want from me? I need that medal. Stasek is willing to let Roman out if I get his medal back. Get it? Of course I do. Okay, listen, everybody wins here. Roman gets out, Stasek gets his medal back, and you... And I get screwed for free. Look, I'll pay you what he owes you, okay? It's not the money. Here, just take the damn thing and get out of here. Here you are, my friend. As promised. Ah, oh, thank you. How about your end of the deal? I'll be right back. Here you are, your new friend, Mr. McPherson. Who are you? Let's just say I know your boss. He's waiting for you at his shop. I'll meet you there later. Whoa, thanks for springing me, mister. You're welcome. Well, that concludes our agreement. Thanks a lot, Kaz. You're welcome. So, go tell your brother it's okay if McPherson goes to see her. Okay, boss. Well, McPherson, looks like you held up your end of our agreement. I'm sending Roman to talk to his brother, which will conclude my end of the deal. Thank you for getting me out of there. You're welcome. I'll see you soon! And now, I've just honored my part of the bargain. You may speak with Vladana any time. I misjudged you, Kabina. No, I don't think so. I have my reasons to protect this girl. Here. Before you leave, this might come in handy. Thanks. Are you sure you're not a nice guy after all? No, I'm not. Now get out of here. Thank <laughs> you.